Hi, how are you? So as you can see, I have this little Sephora by my side. So you can see what you can buy at Sephora for $100 or to give you some ideas, everything that is here is cruelty-free and vegan. So without talking anymore, let's begin. So a little backstory, I had $100 in a gift card that I got for Mother's Day from my sister, Cindy. So I don't tend to buy from Sephora. She went with me to the store at the mall. So she helped me pick the things that I have here. And I only chose things that I really do need or things that I'm about to run out. So you can see some ideas that you want to check out. Let's take the things out. So the first thing that I have here is Kat Von D Concealer Cream lock it and i love the packaging I mean, anything kat von d i love and i have her two perfumes right here if you follow me on instagram you saw that i have i have both bottles the white perfume and the black perfume i have it there so anything kat von d i like for being cruelty free vegan i really haven't tried a lot of her makeup um the one that i got here is light 11 neutral tone <laughs> and when we take it out this is how it looks like i love the packaging i like how paint looks like it's falling here it's beautiful <laughs> wow okay Ooh. oh oh so you can see how the tip looks like So another thing that I picked is this Extreme Longwear Liquid Eyeliner, which has passion flower and agave. I love that. And it's by the brand Bite. And when I was looking for eyeliner, it was important for me that I bought something not with like, like the pen tip, but like a stencil, like a paintbrush. Because I feel like the ones that look like a pen, they start accumulating makeup at the tip and so then it doesn't feel the same so i feel like it's better having the tip that looks like a brush and i got this in solid black and so this is how it looks like i love the rose gold tone which kind of matches my watch you twist the cap It feels hard to pull out. Oh my gosh, <laughs> I'm making a mess. You can see the tip there. It just smells like a flower. Wow, it looks really black. So I also found this full body mascara with berry wax, also by the brand Beauty Bite, or Beauty Bite, or Bite Beauty. As you can see, I am not a big Sephora fan. I'm going to guess it's Bite Beauty. This is the travel size. Let's open it. Oh, it's so tight. Oh, I love the packaging color, also rose gold. Ooh, ah. I can already tell I like the mascara one. I don't know why I love smelly makeup. <laughs> it smells like a rose. This would be like a nice thumbnail. Mm. <laughs> oh, I like that when you close it, it makes a little clip. Oh, I love that. That way you can make sure that you closed it really well. I love that. I love little details like that. Flat, flat. Ooh. 
my mom calling me, but I really want to finish filming. <clears throat> okay, what was I talking English or Spanish? Okay, so I was also able to find this perfume by Rosie Jane, just like my name, Rosie, <laughs> but I spell mine with a Y. Well, it's my nickname, not really my name, but this one has jasmine, vanilla, no parabens, no flat, la <coughs> flat leads, no nasties, vegan, cruelty free. So, um, looks really nice. It smells really nice. When I was at the store, I was between this one and another one that I forgot the name, but this one was, um, I remember liking three perfumes. This was one of my top three and my sister helped me pick this one. So thank you. Um, yeah. And this is how it looks like. It's so beautiful. Oh. I didn't expect this for this to open like this. Oh. Oh my gosh. I opened this the wrong way. <laughs> so do not twist it. Just take off the cap. I already forgot what this smells like. We bought this like a week ago. I'm scared. <laughs> oh my gosh. It smells so nice. Oh my gosh. This smells wonderful. And for me to like a perfume, I really like because I'm picky. I love it. Mmm. It's like the perfume smell lifted up my spirit. So these four items, as you can see, they're only treble size. They are not full size. And the total came up to be $97.37, which I think we did a good job at picking these items. And so with the leftover money, my sister picked this mask, this watermelon mask, which this cost $5.50. I think that's a little expensive just for a mask. Um, I'm not a big fan, but um, she really is into masks. Like, I don't have anything against masks. It's just that I don't give it importance. If I have one on hand, then yes, I'll use it. So this was $5.50 with the leftover gift card. I only paid $3.26. So this concludes this mini haul from Sephora. Some items that you can buy for $100 to give you some ideas. Have you tried any of these products? Let me know. I would love to know in the comments section. Don't forget, you can follow me on all social media pages with the same name, Lynn Sire. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you next time. Kisses. Bye.